Okay guys, how frustrated are you when you take the time to create these beautiful Canva graphics only to put them on YouTube or Facebook or Instagram and they are pixelated or grainy or blurry? Well, I'm about to share with you how you can fix that problem. By the way, my name is Jay Stone, Master Brand Strategist here to help you build more bankable brands. All right, so let's get started. So here is a thumbnail that I already created. This is my YouTube thumbnail, um, but I also use this to promote uh, posts for my YouTube channel on Facebook. And what you might not know is that Facebook and Instagram and Pinterest and all the social media websites do something where they automatically downgrade or degrade the quality of your images so that it loads faster and it does not bog down the platform. So here's how you can help uh, yourself to create higher quality images online. So the first thing you do is once you're done with your beautiful design here in Canva, the first thing you want to do is go to where it says download so when I click the download you'll see the default here is PNG right here okay and that's PNG and it's size one so the first thing you can do is to go ahead and upgrade the size to about two okay um, that will help the quality and that will give you the highest uh, quality of the image but what you will find is when you go to upload it on some platforms you might get an error and the arrow will say that your file is too big. So here's the second hack that I'm going to tell you that's actually a lot better. So while this says suggested, you want to go ahead and do a JPEG. Okay, so while the JPEG is a smaller file size, if you go ahead and raise the size, it's usually defaulted to one. If you go ahead and raise it to two, and then you take the quality all the way up to 100%, it will increase the quality and you will find that even online all the social media platforms that your quality will be better okay so that's hack number two and hack number three make sure that your text is large because even if you save it at these these specifications that I've, I've stated here um, because the quality is still going to downgrade or degrade some I recommend that you make your text larger okay at least one and a half times to two times larger than you normally would just so that it's still legible and it still comes across as crisp it still comes across as crisp now you won't see those type of changes I'm gonna go ahead and pull up my PowerPoint um, I did this picture this is the JPEG image here I put in PowerPoint and this one is the PNG image and I'm just gonna you don't see any different any difference in it when you put it inside softwares like PowerPoint Word you really won't see the difference where you see the difference and I'm going back and forth between the two slides and you literally can't see a difference in the quality again where you're going to see the difference is when you put them onto the social media platforms all right so Happy branding, guys. We'll catch you back here on the flip side. Hope this works. Let me know. Thanks.